my man. My man. Thank you to my man. All right, y'all. So I'm back with like a mini. Oh, I got stuff in my mouth. Excuse the mate. Excuse the face, honey, y'all. I was. I just got done eating. But um, yeah, y'all. I got some stuff to talk to y'all about today. Let's get into it, honey. Get into it. So let's just start off right now. I'm doing my makeup. Me and Des about to film a video. So I'm doing my makeup. So I thought I'll talk to y'all. Anyways, now that that's out the um story, y'all. Let's get into y'all. Why I think I got a man. And my man. Thank you to my man. <laughs> I think I got a man, y'all. Like, oh my God. This is my problem. Like, okay, let's do a little backstory. So after the whole me and my baby daddy situation. So if y'all don't know, I think I told y'all. And, and yes, I have on a bra. So excuse me. Um, if y'all didn't watch my previous videos, y'all know about my whole baby daddy situation. The second one. Um, yeah. Blase, blase. So I literally went on like a little self reflection to just be single. Like I literally which is in, like i was saying y'all so if i keep touching my head it's because this part of my head hurts y'all i don't know what i just did to it anywho so i literally took nine months literally celibate talking to i was talking to one dude we're not gonna talk about we gonna talk we ain't gonna talk about who he was but i was talking to this one dude literally like y'all we started hanging out we started hanging out last year this dude literally took me out for my birthday like, we've been hanging out. I was saying before my kid really interrupted me. So, yeah, I was talking to this dude, y'all, for like literally a whole year, y'all. And he was really supposed to be like a rebound to like my baby daddy. But I ended up falling for him. It always happens like that. After he chased me, y'all, he literally chased me down through a mutual friend. And he ended up just being a dick so anyways bypassed that so now i took like literally nine months off just to be like by myself literally y'all i didn't have sex in nine months that's the longest i've ever been without sex um yeah so i literally took nine months off literally not talking to nobody other than that dude but we never did anything y'all like literally we never did anything and now here we are like i reconnected with another ex i reconnected with another ex like why do i keep doing this to myself but this was like this is like an ex from like 2012 2011 like back when i was in hair school that's like when i first really started youtube um so i didn't really uh talk about my relationship status back then so, y'all probably don't know nothing about him, which y'all don't know nothing about him. And y'all not going to know nothing about him because I'm not going to really tell y'all a lot. But, yeah, y'all. So, he hit me up actually earlier this year and I kind of rejected him because me and Kobe's daddy was still talking or whatever. And, you know, I kind of just brushed him off trying to play gangsta or whatever. And then, like, I get on Facebook dating and he was on there so i was like let me be petty and let me go like his profile picture on facebook so of course me being me me being the girl i am i liked it and i know he was gonna like me back because like i'm one of them exes where you can't resist me I, you can't resist me baby so he's one of the ex-boyfriends that he knows i'm gonna come back like we've been we've been going back and forth to each other which i said i was not going to start that this year but you know i'm like what if this my husband for real for real oh that's dead in the back and i'm like what if this is my husband like for real for real so yeah y'all we get to talking the last few weeks and <clears throat> um yeah he like oh you minds you're not going nowhere did this did that and i'm like hold on now so, I don't know, y'all. I think I got a man. I don't know what to think. 
I'm like, am I really like, I feel like that nine month break was definitely enough. I feel like I learned so much about myself. I learned peace. I learned patience. Like, and I'm not really saying he may be my husband. He may not be my husband. It's like, um, this year I'm really going to have fun. Like 2024, I'm going to have fun. Last year I didn't have fun because the whole situation really broke me down to the point where I'm like, I don't think another man's going to want me. Like I was really broken down. So stepping back out there, put myself back out there. It's just like, it feels like I'm that bitch again. Like I got control over my life again and not somebody else. All right, y'all, but I really don't want to make this video long again because I really have to do my makeup because me and Des is really about to film. So make sure y'all tune into the podcast because I may talk about this a little bit more in the podcast. Um, so y'all just stay tuned about my love story because we're on a journey of my love story. So I'm going to be coming on here randomly telling you guys about my love story because my life is very, very, very interesting, y'all. So anywho, let me finish my makeup and I'll see y'all in another video. Bye, girl.